Hello adventurers! We're back with another exciting video on the channel. It's official. Hytale has been confirmed for mobile and consoles. Today, I bring you the latest updates on Hytale, and we'll find out what John Hendricks had to say about this big news that sparked questions for many channel subscribers. So, join me in this edition of the latest Hytale news segment. But before we dive in, a very important message. If you enjoy this type of content, and want to see more videos like this on the channel throughout the year, please hit the like button on this video. If you're not subscribed yet, subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications so that this video reaches more people, allowing us to continue bringing you more Hytale content. At the beginning of this year, we were a bit inactive. As I mentioned in the last video, the developers were on vacation, and like them, we decided to take a break to recharge until we had relevant news to share, which is the case today. Now that we've recharged our energies with well-deserved vacations, after a start to the year without major announcements, we're back in full swing, just like our dear John Hendricks, who has arrived with a bombshell confirmation, the first of the year to awaken the adventurers who were on vacation. Follower Guy Barreto recently asked the developers, is there any chance of having Hytale on mobile, and if so, will it be very heavy? In terms of gigabyte of internal memory, have a great week to all of you. John, without much hesitation, confirmed clearly and directly, yes, we'll be on mobile. We'll work to keep the installation size reasonable. This way, John put an end to the doubts about whether we would have a mobile version or not. Despite having commented on the topic before, this is the first time he has confirmed it clearly, especially after the change of the Hytale engine. This is very exciting especially now that they are in a more advanced stage of the process, leading us to believe that we will have a mobile version from the launch. Something very interesting to highlight is that he mentioned they intend to leave and maintain a reasonable installation size. Considering everything we've seen and the potential of the game, we imagined it wouldn't be too small. However, he emphasizes that they want to keep it a reasonable size, indicating that they are thinking of delivering the game with quality so that even more popular phones can run it, making access to the game more democratic. It could be a marketing strategy to reach the maximum number of players, making it a popular game. Well, shortly after that, another follower took advantage of the opening left by this question and decided to ask, John, once you replied in a post that Hytale would be released for mobile. Now I ask, Will it be released for consoles as well? John was very direct, sparing words, responding only with a clear and resounding yes. The response was pertinent, even if it was short. I imagine he doesn't want to comment much on that now. However, we can now look forward to the game on both mobile and consoles, which is definitely exciting. After these more conclusive answers, John and the other developers limited themselves to social interactions with the community without answering any more relevant questions. However, I'm keeping an eye out to bring you everything firsthand. So that's it, folks. We've reached the end of another video in the channel news segment. Maybe I'll bring a few videos this month, but I believe that as soon as they start answering more questions, we'll return to the normal channel frequency. Adventurers, if you've made it this far and enjoyed the video, let me know. Respond in the comments on which platform you intend to play Hytale. Remember to leave a like on the video and share it with your friends. I'll be back with more videos on the channel soon, see you soon. Until next time, adventurers.